Hi everyone, uh, it's uh, been good to have had a little time away uh, over the weekend and it's good to be back with you today. I hope you're having a great day wherever you are. It is summertime and uh, as the, the old saying goes, it's summertime and the living is easy. I'm pretty sure that was a line from a famous musical. Well, it's summertime and I'm thankful for a crew of dedicated students who have said yes to the invitation to come and to serve at this church uh, during the summer. So uh, thanks uh, students for uh, your willingness to uh, be involved in that. I'm, I'm excited for this crew and uh, I, I think we can all look forward to all of their contributions that they'll be making uh, during the summer. Well, summertime often makes me think of uh, two of the greatest t-shirt slogans I have ever encountered. Uh, the first one was a, a picture, a big picture on the t-shirt of a uh, a big yellow uh, dandelion and the slogan underneath of it was I fought the lawn and the lawn won. Or uh, the second one that uh, always sticks out in my mind, gravity, colon, not only a good idea, it's the law. Law. Well, law means standard, of course, and, and it's been, uh, I've been reading a bit today, uh, this morning, about uh, uh, the difference between cynics and skeptics seems like a strange uh, thing for a uh, pastor to be reading about, but it uh, certainly uh, fits well in uh, life and ministry, though, uh, that it's helpful for us to know the difference between cynics and skeptics. But uh, there's something that, uh, that really uh, bonds them together that uh, is a common th theme for them, uh, that uh, cynics and skeptics both need uh, the law, just like uh, any of the rest of us. And uh, in fact, uh, in a world that's dominated by individualism and uh, the relativism that uh, f flows from uh, uh, people being ruggedly individual, uh, will never go wrong by appealing to the standard. God's standards are in the Bible because they're true. And they're true because they're in the Bible. You see, uh, God speaks to us his truth. And uh, his truth can be demonstrated. And uh, as we uh, work through his truth, with, uh, with even with cynics or skeptics that come our way, uh, as we point to the, the great logic of what God has told us in his word, and uh, uh, we realize that uh, those truths stand on their own. We can easily say, it's not my word, it's what he says. And he says it because he knows what is best for us. So I love that, that, that word, that famous word from Deuteronomy chapter 6. It's a reminder to us. The Lord our God, the Lord is one. He is the standard, and we never go wrong by living by the standard. Well, I hope you're having a great day. God bless you. And if you uh, have a good t-shirt slogan, I'd love for you to send it in to me. Uh, they can be added to my, my file of, uh, of good slogans that uh, remind us about God's truth. You have a great day. Just to give you a little behind the scenes, I am using a piece of scrap paper with a beautiful star of Bethlehem for my uh, video today and to take my notes. So uh, uh, just so you know uh, what happens behind the, behind the scenes.